You know, my mom said I had perfect handwriting at the age of five, so I think that my whole life I was creating things, but I, I never considered it as a profession until I took an art class in college, actually, when it was like, wow! That, you know, that was, that was it. Hi, my name's Laura, and I make art here in River Forest, Illinois, and I have done so for the past 14 years. I moved here from Anchorage, Alaska. And before then, I lived in London for four years, and New York, and Boston, and Paris, and Seattle, actually. But anyway, um, the way I conceive my subject matter is really kind of just my life. Um, relationships, family relationships, marriage relationships, lover relationships, my relationships with space, with light. The way that I've categorized my work throughout my entire career is, is sort of through a series of, um, or different series I should say. I've got the marriage series and the um, family series and the party series and the living room and the dining room and the bedroom series and, and just spaces that I think humanity inhabit in general, mentally, physically, whatever. And um, and also during all those series I, I, I make etchings with, in the series, I paint, I draw, and um, watercolors as well. Well, the way you could create interest in a picture is I guess, well, I guess composition. I don't know how, how, how to explain what it is that interests me in a, in a specific um, visual, other than I want to make it seem really big and, you know, to go, I want the space to keep going and going through rooms and rooms and rooms, so it delivers sort of an interest and, um, and hopefully you're surprised by at things that you see on the pictures. You get, you get a tougher skin as, as an artist, um, that you don't care so much what other people think, but you really do like it when they like it though. It's true, for sure. I mean, I, when I finish a body of work, I usually need to cleanse my palette by using another body of work, so if I finish a bunch of landscapes, then I'll do maybe some Cosmos series or some, you know, abstract um, things just to put my, my brain in a whole other realm of just color and composition and gravity. The planet is full of information, <laughs> full of fodder for work and life and, you know, humanity. That's, that's the biggest struggle, I suppose, for all artists is, is um, measuring your success by how much work you sell. And that's always a difficult thing, I think. Thank you.